electromagnetic interference and electromagnetic compatibility lab is one of the center of excellence in GARC facility. EMI EMC lab has two vehicle level and two component level semi-anechoic chambers. Larger chamber is used for light and heavy commercial vehicles with an 11 meter diameter turntable integrated with chassis dynamometers. Similarly, small chamber is used for two and three wheeler testing which has 6 meter diameter turntables integrated with chassis dynamometers. Radiated immunity test can be performed with severity levels up to 200 volt per meter and 600 volt per meter by using radar pulse method. Radiated emission for vehicle level tests can be measured from 30 MHz to 40 GHz for off-board tests and from 150 kHz to 2 GHz for on-board tests. The radiated emission tests for component level are performed inside the ALSE chambers on a metal top table with a frequency range of 9 kHz to 18 GHz. The radiated immunity tests for component level can be carried over with frequency range from 100 kHz to 18 GHz. The bulk current injection test facility can perform from 1 MHz to 400 MHz using current probe with max current 300 mA and from 400 MHz to 3 GHz using TWC. The conducted emission test can be performed using voltage method and current probe method. The conducted transient immunity test can be performed up to 100 ampere for 12 volt, 24 volt and 48 volt components. Electrostatic discharge tests are performed by air discharge modes and contact discharge modes up to plus 30 kV. The conducted transient emission test can measure emissions of power and supply lines up to 100 ampere for 12 volt, 24 volt and 48 volt systems. Harmonics and flicker test is used to measure the harmonic current and flicker generated by the electric and electronic device up to 75 ampere. This lab also has electrical fast transient test setup which includes an EFT generator with single phase CDN with 16 ampere and three phase CDN with 100 ampere current rating. The EMC lab also has a facility to measure harmonic immunity of supply voltage in charges.